This is a video for the members of Davian Park Golf Club on how to use the BRS Golf app. On the bottom right of my screen is the Play Store. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to search for BRS Golf, which has come up, and I'm going to click on it. You may have to install this on your phone if you haven't installed it before. I have installed it so I can open it. Before I put my username and password in, I just want to emphasise the importance of this app. In the future, after coronavirus um, restrictions may be lifted uh, by the government, uh, possibly allowing some golf to take place in some shape or form, we will be asking our members to book into competitions and also for day-to-day -day tea times remotely, and it will be through this app. You can still ring the pro shop and book a tea time, but it's easier to use this app because you can access it at any time during the day. So I've set up a, an imaginary user for this demonstration and the username is always a five digit passcode which you can ask myself for. Uh, I'm Martin, the professional at Davian Park. Just contact me if you need your username and you can set up your own password. So I'm going to sign into the app. This app's very easy to use. So... This is the home screen. So you can see we have um, some options here. The, the top one is to book a tea time. And the one underneath would show any upcoming bookings. At the moment, I don't have any upcoming bookings due to the uh, restrictions that we have um, not allowing any golf. Uh, underneath, we have upcoming competitions. These have been set up for demonstration purposes. Um, we don't know when golf will return, but... I thought this video would be useful for people to watch and, and learn how to use BRS. So competitions would be at the bottom. I've set this user up as a lady member and it's important to know that the category that you are under on BRS is very important because it will dictate um, what, what you are allowed to do within the app. If you're a seven day member male, uh, you should have access to the tea sheet seven days of the week, including the Saturday competitions. And if your category wasn't in that seven day membership, then that could cause problems um, in, in entering competitions. So we're into the app and we're going to demonstrate, first of all, general tea time bookings. So for a general tea time booking, we want to book a tea time, which is the blue at the top. And it takes me automatically to today. First thing to always check is to scroll to the top of the, the sheet and see if there's any um, messages on the T sheet, which on this day there actually is. In the grey box there, we can see the initial part of this message and we're going to click on the I icon to the right, which expands the message. And as we can see now, this is a message um, of the rules uh, that we're... Um, that we're putting onto the golf um, for the first phase after restrictions may be lifted. So um, there's some rules there um, that you can read and, and we'd like you to abide to. Okay. So if we go down to a tea time that we can book for a demonstration. Let's say 4.29. We can see that it says reserved for members. So that means within this tea time, there will only be members allowed to book to book within that tea slot. One thing about the tea sheet on this particular day, which is different to how it will look um, on our initial phase back, is that the tea time intervals are eight minutes. They will actually be 10 minutes um, when we, when we um, come back to golf. Don't know when we will be coming back to golf, but this video will be useful um, to show how to book a tea time for all our membership. So the tea time intervals will be 10 minutes. So if I wanted to book 4.29, then I would look to the right. We can also see that there's an X. The X is filling the fourth spot. So on this particular slot, we would only be allowed to book three players. So when I've clicked into it, we only allow three players. Three players is a best case scenario for phase one of our reintroduction of golf. Uh, we sent out some correspondence a couple of days ago 
Um, a lot of golf clubs are saying two balls. We would really like to do three balls. So if the English Golf Union and the government are, will allow three balls and it is an option between two and three balls, then we will be going down the line of, of three balls. So fingers crossed for that. So player one, if I click onto player one, it will automatically add the username that I'm using, which is the one that I've set up as a test. So player two and three, usually you could add uh, guests if you have them. Uh, our first phase of reintroduction of golf will not allow guests and, and there will be no visitors either. It will just be for members. So the setting that allows you to add guests will be taken away temporarily. So player two, I could search any other member. So I'm going to actually add Charlie Ward, who's our assistant in the pro shop. And then I can also add player three. I'm going to add Mark Perry. Okay, so we have a three ball there. If I was to just book player one as myself, before the coronavirus stopped playing golf, stopped us playing golf, I would basically own that tea time. So player two and three wouldn't have been able to be filled by, by any other members we have changed this setting. So if I was to just book player one as myself, then player two and three could be filled by other members. This has been a really important change because we feel the demand of golf um, when we do return, uh, hopefully in the near future, um, is going to be very high, the demand. So we want to maximise the tee sheet as much as we can. So we have allowed player two and player three uh, to be accessed by other members. Of course, the positive of that is we may make some new friendships. Um, we still have to um, practice the social distancing, but we may make some friendships and play with some golfers that we've not played with before, which is always a good thing. Now, if I press book, which I'm going to do, all three of those players will get an email notification to say that the tea time has been booked. If there's any changes to this tea time, there would be a notification sent to all three players also, which is a really good setting because if it was a competition and somebody was to pull out within a couple of days, we may be able to find a replacement for that slot. So it's important that um, you, when you first sign into BRS, that when it asks if you would like to allow email notifications, you, you'd be better putting that setting as yes so that you get these um, these changes through on your email. So I'm going to press book. And as you can see, on 4.29 there, um, we now have three players. That's in five minutes' time. So Mark and Charlie are actually going to get an email notification and we're just teasing them because uh, they can't play golf today, but we'll just tease them anyway. So when we go back to the top, I'm going to go to my home. And now you can see appear, appearing in my upcoming bookings is that tea time slot that I've just booked. Just a note on the booking windows, this is the amount of time in advance that we allow uh, members and visitors to book. Uh, visitors is usually five days. Uh, this is um, going to be zero days because we're not allowing visitors or guests in this initial reintroduction. Um, and members is usually 14 days booking window. The, the booking window is being changed to seven days in this first phase. Uh, reason being, we want more control over the tea sheet. Uh, we do anticipate that things will change um, even when we come back into golf. Um, hopefully restrictions will be gradually lifted, which means that we may be able to allow four balls in the future. Um, or we may be changing the, the, the diary with um, new competitions, uh, things like this, maybe shotguns further down the line. So we want more control over the tee sheet. So that's why we've changed the booking window to uh, seven days. So we've got our upcoming bookings there. Now, the one below is the upcoming competitions. As we mentioned earlier, these competitions will be tailor-made to whatever category your membership is, is tagged under. So th this person is tagged as a lady member, so it is showing um, under the competitions these reserve slots for, for ladies' uh, roll-up play. 
so if we were to click um as we can see as well booking opens on monday the 11th of may so it's 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 not open for booking yet again this is just a test competition it's it's not an actual competition that's going to take place so when we click into it you can see it takes us we got 9 30 up until 11 30 okay so if we were to book into that slot when the booking opens we can go through the same process and add other members of course those other members would only be lady members because this competition is reserved for the lady membership category so again it's very important that you're you're under the right category uh give, give us a uh, contact us if, if if you feel that you're not so if we go back to home it's as you can see it's it's fairly simple um, any questions, please don't hesitate to, to give me a shout. It's Martin. I'm the pro at Davey and Park Golf Club. Um, really hope to see you soon. Um, hoping some, for some good news tomorrow, which is Sunday off the government, to, to see um, what the future holds. And uh, thanks for your support. We really appreciate it. And as I say, fingers crossed, hopefully see you soon. Thank you.